I'm Bonnie Silkman, and here's tonight's Fox 12 Flash Briefing. The number of COVID-19 cases continues to rise. Today, the Oregon Health Authority confirmed 25 new cases. That brings the statewide total to 139. There have been four deaths. 437 people in the state are now waiting for their results to come back. And in Washington, three more people have tested positive in Clark County. That brings the total there to nine. The state was now over 1,700 cases. That's what they're seeing, and there have been 94 deaths. As cases grow, leaders are now calling on all Oregonians to help stop the spread. Oregon Governor Kate Brown, Portland Mayor Ted Wheeler, and Multnomah County Chair Deborah Kofori held a news conference last night announcing a new campaign called Stay Home, Stay Healthy. They're urging people to stay inside and practice social distancing distancing over spring break statewide. Wheeler says an official stay at home order in Portland will likely come on Monday. That order would mean making major changes to the way we interact from avoiding packed parks to crowded trails. Today though we did see a lot of people in the gorge and at places like Vista House and Multnomah Falls. Many say they're not concerned because they're outside. We also saw a lack of social distancing with how many people were on those narrow trails. Now here's Brian McMillan with a look at our weather. We have one more nice day before things really cool off when we bring back the rain. So tomorrow expect sunshine in the morning, clouds in the afternoon, highs close to 61 and the showers return on Monday. We'll drop those high temperatures down to 50 degrees. Bonnie. All right, Brian, thanks. And for news and weather updates anytime, just download the Fox 12 app on your phone or tablet or you can log into our YouTube channel. That's at youtube.com slash Fox 12.